Hey guys, it's Thunder Splash, and in this episode, we're going to be talking about how to add a collision into your Unreal Engine 5 project. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, so first we're going to do is we're going to right click, look for our blueprint class, look for actor, and rename it. Open it up. After that, we're going to look for cube. And then we're going to go to the event graph. After that, we're going to go to cube again, add event, look for on component hit. Then we're going to go to other actor and look for third person character blueprint. Then we're going to right click and look for print string. And then we're gonna change this to it works. Adjust the duration. Compile, drag it to our scene. And press play. All right, there you go. So whenever the character touches it, um, they'll know that they're colliding with it. All right, now we're gonna add a box collision. All right, we're gonna right click, look for blueprint class, choose actor, and rename this to Collide. Open it up. Then we're gonna look for Box Collision. And then we're gonna go to the Event Graph, select Box, Add Event, and look for On Component Begin Overlap. Go to Other Actor, and look for a Third Person Character. After that, right click and look for print string. Then we'll change the text to cutscene. Adjust the duration. And compile. Drag it to the scene. Okay, so the box collision is cool because if we want to activate a cutscene, all the character has to do is just walk into that area. and then press play. So as you can see, the collision for the cube works. And now the box collision works as well. Um, this is gonna be really good when you're making a really big project and you decide to add in a bunch of different assets and you're trying to test out to make sure the character doesn't run through it. It also lets us know that the character is able to interact with the object as well. Hey guys, if you like these type of videos, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, share this video, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Later.